Deputy President William Ruto has celebrated the collapse of the BBI after Supreme Court dealt a blow to the proponents of the initiative. ODM party leader Raila Odinga welcomed the ruling but said they will not stop deliberations on the way forward that will decide on a future cause of action that protects the interests of all those who voted to see the amendments come to light. Dolly Murigi brings us reactions of the collapse of BBI from various political leaders. The nullification of the Building Bridges Initiative appeal by the Supreme Court on Thursday has elicited mixed reactions from a cross-section of the politicians in the country. Kenya Kwanzaa lands led by the Deputy President William Ruto expressed excitement following the final blow to the Building Bridges Initiative. Ruto, a key opponent of the BBI, say that the Supreme Court verdict marks an end to the collapse of the Building Bridges Initiative. Walikuwa wanaturingia at nobody can stop reggae. Reggae imekwama hijakwama. Reggae imefika tamati hijafika. Imefika mwisho hijafika. And we want to tell our friends, the Handshake Brothers and the BBI fraud they visited on the people of Kenya. Now that it is, come, it is confirmed by the Supreme Court that the BBI and all the shenanigans around it were matters that were unconstitutional, illegal, null and void. Leaders also feel that to Kenya Kwanzaa Alliance took to social media to express satisfaction with the Supreme Court ruling. ANC leader Musale Mudavadi congratulated the Supreme Court judges for what he termed the bold decision which essentially put a stop to the BPI reggae. Ford Kenya leader Moses Otangula expressed his joy saying that he loved his country and now the government and it's the high time to shift focus to the country's economy. On his part, ODM leader Raila Odinga welcomed Supreme Court judgment of the Building Bridges Initiative saying it has a the sovereignty of the Kenyan people, saying that they will not stop deliberations on the way forward that will decide on a future cause of action that protects the interests of all those who voted to see the amendment to come to light. Kotobo's Francis Atuoli via Twitter say the previous judgment on the BBI both in High Court and Court of Appeal were pure politics and not anchored in law. The initiative emerged following the March 9, 2018 handshake between President Kenyatta and ODM leader Raila Odinga. The two reached the truce after months of unrest following the contested election result of the 2017 general election. Dolly Mirigi, Hope TV, Nairobi.